what you're doing. Amen. Amen. Um, you all agree with me that Jesus died, right? Yes. Okay. And you agree that when he died, he was buried, right? Amen. But you also agree that he was rose from the rose from the dead, right? Amen. Right. That is just the exact thing we are doing. But this time we are doing it in the physical. We are doing it in the physical and we want to show that he actually we we when he died, we died with him. Okay? You died with and I know it's a little bit uh, hard for you small ones. It's okay, it's okay. Just calm down. It may be hard for you to understand what it means by we died with Christ. But the little I can help you out to understand this morning that it really happened. <laughs> okay? So we all died with him. Amen? Amen. Amen. We all died with him. And we were buried with him. Amen. And then when he rose, we rose with him. Amen. This is the significance of baptism. This is why we have been baptized. It's for the repentance to sin. We are selling sin. We are no more in relationship with you. Amen? Amen. We are no more in relationship with sin because the reason why Jesus died is for sin. Mm -hmm. Amen? Amen? So we are saying that sin will cut you off today. We have no covenant with you because we are now becoming a new person. Amen. So uh, let, let me share this scripture with you and on your own at home you can take understanding of it. Romans the book of Romans. <clears throat> Jesus Christ was also baptized as a person. But before I get there, I would like somebody to open Romans for me, if you have it. Book of Romans. Amen. Amen. Romans chapter number six. Voice. That's good. Amen. That's to show you that the heaven is already open. Amen. <laughs> right. <laughs> Shall we continue in sin that grace may abound? Paul was speaking to the Roman people. He said, What shall we say? Are we going to continue to be in sin? Are we going to continue to be in sin? Sexual sin, lying, anger, jealousy. Are we going to continue with that? Are we going to, does it really mean, even though we do all this sin, are we still going to continue in that? Yes. God forbid. He said, no, God forbid. How shall we that are dead in sin? Now, this is where he came in. He said, how shall we that are dead in sin? To be dead in sin means that you, you died inside your sin. Okay? Mm -hmm. You have died inside your sin. Mm -hmm. But how did he do it? We did it with Christ. Mm -hmm. It was actually Jesus that died. So, but spiritually, we died with him. Mm -hmm. Amen? Amen? Inside our sin. So, mm -hmm. what's your sin you have committed? Believe that today, as you are submerged inside the water, that sin and yourself died. Amen. 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 Church. Amen. Yes. Live any longer therein. Know ye not that so many of us, as were baptized into Jesus Christ, were baptized into his death? Now, uh, come in. Come in. No, let me have it. Come in. Now, you know. Every time the hands is laid on you, what we are saying is that we are baptizing you in the name of the Father. We baptize you into the name of into the, to be baptized means I put you inside the power of the name. Amen. 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 Inside the power, you are submerged inside the power of the name of the Father, of the name of the Son, name of the Spirit. The same thing, when you are deep inside the water, you are now deep inside that death of Jesus Christ. Amen. Is it, is it, are you getting it now? You are deep inside that death of the Lord Jesus Christ. Therefore, we are buried with him. Now, this is it. Can you all hear that? Amen. Can you all hear God through his word? Therefore, we are all what? Buried. Let me give you a part of it. I want you to go down. I know you are strong. I don't want to press you down. Okay? That's what I think you go down alongside with me. Amen. All right. You watch it now. I want to dip him now in the water. Come on. Did you all see it? Amen. So this is an indication that Jesus fell. He died. Amen. Amen. He died with us. And you too now today. Amen. As I so much inside the water, Amen. you died with Jesus Amen. inside your sin. Is it clear to everybody? Yes. Yes. And I'm going to do it three times. I'll do it in the name of the Father. I'll do it in the name of the Son. I'll do it in the name of the Holy Ghost. So when I yank you up Amen. the third time, you are now living a new life. Amen. You are now living a new life. It is now called 
a life of resurrection. Amen. Amen. In fact, I thank God for that we're able to put this thing now because we are still in the resurrection. Amen. So it's going to be very significant. Amen. 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 Right. Let's finish it. Therefore, we are buried with him by baptism into death. You see that? We are, we are what? Buried with him by, by baptism. baptism. True baptism. Amen. True baptism. We are buried with him into that death. Amen. 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 So our fornication, our lying, our, our jealousy, the anger, negative thought, and all sickness can disappear too. Amen. Amen. Because sin brought them. And Amen. if sin is going, you got to go to. Amen. Amen. Yes. Amen. All right. That like as Christ was raised up from the dead. Just as like Christ was raised from the dead. By the glory of the Father. Even Who is the glory of the Father? Who was the Holy Spirit? The Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit. Yes. The Holy Spirit is involved there now. He was raised by the glory of the Father, which is the Holy Spirit. Then, but as Christ was raised, just the way the Holy Spirit came, removed the grave, removed everything, and Christ came alive. Even so, we also Even should walk. Even so, from now onward, we that are raised now from that baptism, we should now begin to walk in newness of life. In newness of life. Amen. 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 What is that about newness of life? Somebody say resurrection. Resurrection. What is the newness of life? Resurrection. Yeah. It's good to preach with. <laughs> Very simple. All right. How do we do it? The name is significant. Go back to Matthew quickly. Matthew. Matthew chapter 20. Matthew. Yes, Matthew 28. Last project, keep on that person. And if they are not in the project. Matthew 28, verse 18. And Jesus came and spake unto them, saying, Jesus came, he rose now and came and spoke unto them, saying, All power is given unto me. All authority is now mine. In heaven and in earth. In heaven and in earth. Go ye therefore. Apostle Bala. Apostle Bala. Apostle Bala. Go ye therefore. And teach all the nations. So I have come now to teach you. Baptizing them. And I am now baptizing you. In the name of the Father. In the name of the Father. And of the Son. Of the Son. And of the Holy Ghost. And the Holy Ghost. Teaching them to observe. So that you can observe. All things. All things. Whatso whatsoever. Whatsoever. I have commanded you. The Lord commanded us. And lo. I am with you always. So you receive the presence of the living God. Amen. 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 Now, was Jesus also baptized? Amen. Yes. yes. Jesus was baptized. And one thing happened. One significant thing happened. I want all of you to take note of it. In baptism, it happens. Anytime God uses me to do baptism, it happens. It is called open heavens. Amen. Amen. Open heavens is all you need, my dear. Mm -hmm. The struggle for finances, struggle for health, struggle mm -hmm. for this. Once your heaven is open mm -hmm. and you have faith, the angels are going to and fro, mm -hmm. to and fro, to and fro. Remember, I was teaching about angels yesterday. Mm -hmm. So this is one of the greatest things. All of you have angels. Mm -hmm. For all of you here have angels, including the, the smallest person. They all have what? Angels. angels. And the angels will be moving to and fro. Mm -hmm. hey, what do you need? What do you want me to do for you? What do you want me to do for you? They are there for you. Amen. 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 Okay. Go to this is the last scripture I'll give you, not the least. Um, go to St. Matthew, chapter number three. Matthew chapter three, maybe around that uh, check verse sixteen for me. And Jesus, when he was baptized. Now, it was it. So Jesus was baptized. Jesus was baptized. Amen. Amen. So you are like Jesus. Amen. 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 Everything Jesus did, do it. Amen. Every miracle, God can choose you to do it. Amen. Amen. Every success, you can have it. Amen. Heavens will open over you. Amen. Amen. Jesus didn't boss people. Jesus didn't fight people. Jesus didn't lie against people. So you can, on your own, to walk in this unit, Amen. and you will be a healthy man. Amen. Amen. Be busy with the Spirit. Amen. Be busy. Once you are busy in your mind with the Holy Spirit, Amen. you won't sing. Amen. 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 It's, it's being busy with the Holy Spirit. It's when you come out of the Holy Spirit and you start thinking naturally, then you go into all this problem. Amen. The 
let's finish. Went up straightway. He went up straightway. Out of the water. Out of the water. And lo, the heavens were open. What happened? When yeah. the heavens were yeah. open. So hold that. Believe that. Lift up your two hands and say, Lord. Lord, just as it were in your day, just as it were in your day, open my heavens. Open my heavens today. Today, in the name of Jesus.